こんにちは。皆さん、フィリピンからのクリスのチャンネルへようこそご覧いただきありがとうございます。For today's reaction video I am watching, we ask a 19-year-old girl traveling alone to Japan about her impressions of Japan and her wonderful experiences. The video is from this channel. It was suggested by this viewer. Thank you so much for your suggestion. では早速、始めましょう。Thank you so much for your time. And then, first of all,、uh, may I ask you where are you from? So I'm from Slovakia.、Oh, Slovakia? Yeah, do you know Slovakia? Yeah, I know. I've never been. Well, actually, a lot of people don't know Slovakia. They're like, ah, Czechko, Czechko,、mm. like Czech Republic. Oh my. But、uh, yeah, we were once one country, but now we are just Slovakia. It's just、oh. Slovakia. Wow, this is first time to interview people from Slovakia. Yeah, not a lot of people from Slovakia come here in Japan because、wow. the flight tickets are very expensive、oh. and they're also not such a huge fans of Asia. For example,、oh. in my country, we don't really、mm, know what manga is or anime. Oh, really? As well. Wow, that's so interesting. Well, nice to meet you. Thank, Thank you. you. Nice to meet Thank you. Thank you、too. so much for that. Wow.、Uh, What brought you to Japan? Okay, so I'm taking a gap year.、Mm. I just finished my high, high school studies.、Mm. Gap year. And I'm thinking about what university to attend. So I actually decided to come to Japan.、Uh, when I was in Barcelona, I bought, I, like, bought tickets.、Mm. Uh, it was.、Uh, Unplanned. I didn't plan this trip. It was really unexpected. But now I'm here. Actually, my mom doesn't know that I'm in Japan.、Oh, really? <laughs> no.、Oh、no. And I also, like, I called my、uh, brother、um, that, oh, yeah, so tomorrow I'm uh, actually uh, getting a flight, getting on a flight to Japan. And he was like, what? Are you joking right now? And I was like, no, <laughs> like, actually, in a couple of hours. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, so no one really knows. Yeah. So your mom still d o n t know you are in Japan? No, my mom still doesn't know I'm in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. So, when did you come to Japan? I came to Japan in November, in, at the end of November.、Ah. And so I stayed for two and a half months. It was a great experience. I actually did some volunteering in Shikoku as well.、Mm. Uh, I stayed in Tokyo for some time. I attended classes to learn Japanese, so I speak kind of a bit Japanese. Oh, oh wow.、Okay. Mm. Because of my travel visa, my travel visa almost ends.、Mm. I have to go back. Oh, of course. But I would stay. <laughs> I would definitely stay. You want to stay? Yeah, I want to stay, of course. Okay, <laughs> I'm happy to hear that. Okay, but so. You, before you were in、mm. Barcelona, right? Yeah, I was in Barcelona because of my gap year. I choose like, to travel to a lot of countries. So I've been to Bosnia Herzegovina,、oh. I've been to Vienna, I've been to Croatia. Like,、uh, these are very、um, normal countries to visit and,、uh, when you're European. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then I came to London. It was my transit between、uh, Barcelona and coming here to Japan,、mm. to Tokyo. Before you were in Europe, but why, why you decided to come to Japan? Uh, it was always my dream to come to Japan.、Oh, yeah. uh, and I actually wanted to go to China and then go to Nepal because of the volunteering opportunities there.、Oh, yeah, yeah, But yeah. I panicked because in China you don't have Wi Fi, right? You don't have like a Google,、uh, nothing、uh, really works there, no yeah, maps. I so I panicked and I just bought tickets to Japan instead.、Mm. Uh, you said you always wanted to come to Japan, right? Yes. But why? Like, what made you? I think because of the culture. We don't really know. So, like, people really don't、mm. know.、Um, What Asian culture, how Asian culture is very、uh -huh. rich. And I'd say I was very curious about the Asia.、Uh -huh. And I chose Japan because、uh, I heard Japan is very safe.、Uh, yeah. That's the first thing. I heard that、um, there are many shrines, there are many good food.、Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that's why I chose to go to Japan.、Uh, also, anime is kind of like、um, a bit of a factor here.、Oh, okay. When I came here, I didn't like.、Um, I didn't know hiragana, katakana, I didn't know kanji. I、yeah. couldn't speak. All I could say was like, konnichiwa,、wow. arigatou gozaimasu.、Oh. But it was like it. And I, once I was in a convenience store and I, I didn't know that you aren't supposed to say sayonara. Yes,、yeah, so、I said like sayonara multiple times to a lot of people and people were like, Mm. Uh, <laughs> I'm really yeah,、okay. like, surprised that I,、okay. I shouldn't say that. <laughs> But wow, like, that's so, I don't know, you are、uh, very brave because、yes. you came to Japan, but you didn't know about like, You didn't know the Japanese language or anything? Yeah, I didn't know, but I learned. Now I can pretty speak with locals.、Wow. I can understand yeah, yeah. very much. Wow. Like a big deal.、Wow. I've been learning Japanese actually for two months. Since I was volunteering in Shikoku, there were like a lot of people that were Japanese and couldn't speak English. So that made me want to learn Japanese more and more, like interact、uh, with them.、Yeah. So I learned like basic phrases. And Japanese actually language is a very nice language. You cannot, I think. You cannot say anything bad、mm -hmm. when、mm -hmm. speaking Japanese. Because、yeah, yeah. everything is like very, very. Yes, I see. Oh, yeah,、uh, true, true.、Mm. You, you said you are 19, right? I、yeah. am 19, yeah, yeah that's、wow. true. And then before you have friends here? 
Or yeah. Uh, do you have friends? Before? I didn't know anyone here. Oh my god, so you are <gasps> I didn't completely know alone here. Yeah, completely alone, but I got to meet a lot of friends. Yeah, and yeah. I cried a lot because now it's my last day here. Oh, yeah. And um, I cried a lot because I met beautiful friendships that will, I, I hope, that oh. will last. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, mm. okay. That's an interesting story. Okay, so when you came to Japan, like last mm. November, first, mm. time, uh, first time, what kind of impression did you have? I was very surprised like uh, how organized Japan is, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, how beautiful the language sounds also. Mm. I was surprised how people, um, how clean everything is oh, yeah, and yeah. how safe Japan is. Mm. I actually lost my bag in the train station in Osaka wow. and I got it back. Wow. My friend was Japanese and he managed to call every station, oh. like JR lines or Metro lines oh. and everything. And we found it. We were able to find it, oh. so I don't think I have a bad experience here. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah. I really want to come back. It's, it's been a, yeah, it's been a beautiful experience here. Of course. What kind of impression do you have in terms of Japanese people? Like? I cannot really put all Japanese into one bag. Yeah, I know. I'd say like Osaka's uh, like Japanese um, that lives in Osaka. Huh? Are very very like uh, open. Uh -huh. uh, for example, I. I wanted to ask for a lighter, so I went to a nearby restaurant. An old lady ca uh, came to me, and she was like, "Ah, oh, kikire, like you're beautiful." <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, "Ah, oh, sunna Oh yeah. And she was like, um, "Yeah, do you need lighter? Oh, I, I, I don't have a lighter, but uh, I'll ask." So she went to a restaurant. She didn't find it, so she went to a nearby bar. And she asked for a lighter there, so I got the lighter for my friend, oh. <laughs> and she was like, "Matakitene, like come oh. back, like sh be sure to come back." Mm. So people in Osaka were very nice to me, but I heard that people in Kyoto are very close. That Kyoto, oh. yeah, um, are very close. That they all don't open up and they don't really mm. like strangers. Mm -mm. People in Tokyo, I'd say they are very introverted. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I really like Tokyo. Oh, of course. Mm. So I kind of enjoy this intro area. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. okay. You said like you are in Shikoku, like volunteer? Yeah, I was a volunteer what in Shikoku. What kind of volunteer? So it was like a job in the farm. So every every day we would wake up and we would like uh, go harvesting some vegetables. Oh. And then we would pack them or something or we would like um, plant new seeds, like new mm. vegetables. Then oh. we would like soil the ground like mm. and so on. And then like um, after 1 p.m. we had like free time. And Shikoku is very beautiful because it has a lot of mo lots of mountains, right? Yeah, yeah. A lot of good onsen, a lot mm. of great food and a lot of places to travel. Mm. So we made like day tr daily trips uh, mm. with my friends that were also volunteers from another country. Oh, yeah. mm. I think it was worth experience and I really enjoyed it but um, yeah at the end it was very uh, difficult to leave. Oh, mm. yeah, yeah. How many like cities have you ever been like Shikoku? And then... I actually hitchhiked. Uh, so wow. Actually, first I arrived to Tokyo. Mm -hmm. I stayed here for for three weeks. Uh -huh. Then I decided to go to Shikoku. Shikoku. Uh -huh. Yeah, and then uh, I stayed there like one month, one month and a half. Mm -hmm. I don't know uh, the exact weeks. But then we decided to hitchhike. So we hitchhiked from Tokushima mm -hmm. to Naruto, and from Naruto to Kobe, and then we took a train from Kobe to Osaka, and oh. we spent some days in Osaka to explore. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then I went to Kyoto with Japanese friends, actually. Wow. <laughs> with Japanese friends. So actually, this uh, hat I uh, bought in Osaka. Hmm? And so the guy that uh, sold, it, sold it to me, he was very nice. So we like uh, got to know each other. <laughs> and then the next day, I bought funny. him an ice cream because we were like, we made a promise to go out that night. Oh, yeah. But uh, I couldn't attend. So I was feeling very sad, so I brought him an ice cream the next day mm. and I told him like, but yeah, but like this is the last like bye bye because tomorrow like I leave, I go to Kyoto. Oh, he was yeah. like, Sahara goes to Kyoto? Okay, then me too. Wow. And I was like, you go also to Kyoto. And he was like, yeah, today is like, tomorrow is my day off. Uh. Like we can hang, hang out in Kyoto, it's just 30 minutes oh, by yeah. train. So he actually went with me to Kyoto and we went like to Fushiminari. Wow, wow yeah. that's... I have great memories. Wow. <laughs> but he couldn't speak English at all. So we just, uh, yeah, it was like a translator all the time. Oh, uh, but yeah. I, c I can actually speak Japanese like a bit. So oh. I was very trying hard. Mm, okay, mm. okay. That's interesting. <laughs> that's true. Wow, wow. I also tried couch surfing for oh, the first time in my life. Yeah, a nice experience. Oh, uh, yeah. I stayed with a like a 20 year old boy. It was very good. I actually stayed at his house. Really? 
Yeah, so couch, couch surfing like it's it's an app where uh, people like can host like uh, different nationalities, yeah, yeah. like different foreigners oh. and stuff. And so I applied, and the host like said to me, "Yeah, of course you can come mm. to my house. You can live with me." So he he also bought me some of the sweets. Like here, I have a bag full of sweets. That wow. Wow. <laughs> yeah, very nice people. Mm, but, but now I just it's my last night wow, here, okay. yeah. last night, last wow. day. But how is, is it not like dangerous, like staying in the yes. guy's house? I think it is, but this is like very fed up, and I wanted to try it. Also, I want to. All I want to <laughs> is to write into my CV. She's so brave. Like, I've tried this, 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 because it's my gap year. I really want to try everything. Oh wow! wow. For example, I wouldn't try this like in the other countries, mm. but. I decided to try it here mm. because I've always like I heard about this app. My friends tried it. And, and they said it was great because oh. you hang out with local, right? Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. And actually, it's, it's very a great friendly because uh, these people can speak only Japanese to you. Yeah. And you can speak only English, so kind of you like learn Japanese and they learn English. Uh, it's really convenient. Course. Okay, okay. Many foreigners like goes to like Tokyo, Osaka, Nara, Kyoto. Yes. So this time I wanna ask you like, what's your favorite? city except Tokyo, Osaka, Kyoto, Nara. <laughs> I think I'll go uh, I think I'll go with Tokushima. Tokushima? Yeah. Oh, okay. Why? It has good uh, udon. Oh, <laughs> and I really enjoyed onsen there. And mm. also in Tokushima, uh, there are like um, a lot of places nearby, a lot of towns nearby. Mm -hmm. And they are very they are very quiet and mm. silent and people are just there for gardening or some sort of jobs, oh, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They they are very old and they like live their life mm -hmm. uh -huh. just there in silence. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very calm. Oh, yeah. I actually want to go to the south of Japan mm. and see I don't know the name of the gate. There's like a Tori gate on the sea. It's like near Hiroshima. Near Hiroshima? Near Hiroshima. Miyajima? Mm. Itsukushima Jinja. Oh, why do you want to go there? So once I painted uh, this gate, I didn't know like the name of the gate and uh -huh. I gave it as a present to my best friend. Yeah, now when I come, came to Japan, I actually like was looking at like uh, where to go, like searching for places, uh -huh. you know, and I saw this gate and I was uh -huh. like, oh no, but I, I draw this, Wow. you know? So the dream really came true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'd really like to come back and just uh, of course, yeah, see my drawing in uh, uh, yeah, real. Yeah. In real light. So now this time, so in general, what's your favorite city place? You can choose everything. What do you want? Everything? Yeah. What's I had really the best experience in Osaka oh, okay. because I was there with my friends, and we really enjoyed it. I actually, I actually uh, draw on like a carton box. Kareshi, kareshi o sagashite Okay. And I went to like uh, random people, like with my friend, and yeah. I was like, Oh, can I see your <laughs> And they were like, Oh, Madzi! Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. I was like, Honto. <laughs> really? Yeah, so I made a lot of Japanese friends even more. Like, they added me on Instagram, and then they wrote me, like, uh, Do you want to go to sushi together tomorrow? And I was like, Oh, Motiron. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, let's go together. Oh. But the next day I was in Kyoto, so... Ah, oh, you couldn't go? I couldn't go, I couldn't attend. Oh, but you enjoy like something, those... Oh, uh, this was the bikes. best experience. This was okay. the really big, oh best experience. Oh my god. I wouldn't do this alone, but I was with friends. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it was like very just a fun way to interact with oh, everybody. Oh, okay. that's cool. Yeah, okay. it was just a dumb idea, but I love dumb ideas. Okay. And so like you just said, like uh, also you like food, but uh, uh, what, what's your favorite one then? It was always ramen. Mm -hmm. Ramen? Always it was ramen. Okay. Yeah, what, but... What, what taste? What taste? Uh, it's kind of difficult. Miso tonko to show you shio. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I can't choose really. But what surprised me was like how cheap everything is. Mm -hmm. oh, like yeah. you get like onigiri. Uh -huh. It's not really like mm, difficult to buy, you uh, know? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's really cheap. What's your onigiri, like favorite ingredients? So... It's tsunamayo. Ah, tsunamayo. Yeah, everyone loves everyone tsunamayo. Loves, yeah, 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 me too. Oh, <laughs> I'm yeah. not an exception. What is your favorite food in uh, Japan? In Japan? Oh, you're asking. Oh, you're interviewing me. <laughs> yeah, you, you have it, you have it. Oh. So, what is your favorite food in Japan? Oh, my favorite food? Of course, like, mm. like yeah. Of course. course. <laughs> sushi. Sushi. Uh, sushi is, of course, but I also. Ramen? Yeah, this is the typical one, but yeah. uh, I also love the. Do you know unagi? Unagi? I don't know unagi. Eel. Do you know in eel? The fish. Yeah, I know eel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
very st- so is your favorite like food yeah it's very delicious and very traditional yeah. japanese food but it's okay. kind of expensive so yeah what about your favorite <laughs> ramen because you mentioned oh uh, yeah like, okay okay kinds of ramen of course tonkotsu yeah tonkotsu i love tonkotsu yeah i know it's like very fat but it's super delicious and then it's very delicious yeah i actually watched a tv show on netflix uh-huh. and it was uh I don't know what it was. I watched just the first episode. I thought it was really weird and I like I didn't watch the second episode. The episode was actually about tonkotsu ramen. Oh, yeah, yeah. So the next day I saw like tonkotsu ramen because I can read a bit hiragana oh, and katakana. Wow. And I said like to, to, tonkotsu ramen. Tonkotsu ramen. Yeah. I was like, "Oh my god, I saw this yesterday like on my episode that I didn't <laughs> like, that I really disliked." So I just went into the restaurant and I just ordered like one tonkotsu ramen. Oh, wow, really? That's interesting. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great, great interview. Yeah, you can continue. You may yeah. continue. Nihon no daigaku sen thank you desu yo ne. Thank you. Arigatou gozaimasu. I'm so happy actually that I want to cry. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much! This was a nice interview. I really enjoyed their conversation. This 19-year-old girl is so brave. And she just finished her high school and she's going around the world alone. She's really brave. She's very adventurous and she's so friendly. I love her personality. It's totally opposite my personality. She loves to try everything. For a few months that she stayed in Japan, she learned so many things. At first, she knew a little bit about Japan. But when she spent some months in Japan, she learned so much. Even the language, even reading. She's a very smart lady. Japan is really safe to travel alone, especially for ladies. Well, anyway, it was a great video. Thank you so much to the uploader. I'm a subscriber. And to my viewer who suggested the video, thank you so much. To all my viewers, Ishinimate Kurete Arigato. Minasan Ketsukete. Mata ne!